What does it mean when we speak of a lumbar fusion of 360 degrees? In this x-ray, we can see that there is an implant placed from the front and also screws from the back. So 360 degrees means it's a circumferential fusion from the front and the back. Usually, however, the front portion of the procedure is done first with a vascular surgeon approaching the spine and accomplishing the fusion from the front. In this implant, screws are placed and this is called a standalone cage. You can potentially leave this cage by itself and not supplement it with pedicle screws, but uh, most surgeons would agree that you achieve a more stable construct when you put pedicle screws in the back after the front fusion was done with this type of an implant. And this is the final outcome after the implant was placed from the front, we then moved the patient to the back, turned them around, we made an incision, and we put these pedicle screws. And in this fashion, the spine is held from the front by this cage and from the back by these pedicle screws. And this is what's called a 360 degree fusion.